All new this midday, the vice president has touched down in Hampton Roads. Thank you for joining us. I'm Katie Collette. And I'm Don Roberts. Tanya Osai was there as Air Force Two landed at Naval Station Norfolk in the last hour. Vice President Mike Pence has a busy day planned on the base. Tanya Osai's Andy Fox has the details on his visit. I'm in hangar bay number two on the aircraft carrier Harry S. Truman, and we are awaiting the arrival of Vice President Mike Pence. He will get a full tour of the ship, and then he will come up here and speak to sailors here in the hangar bay. And with me right now is Lieutenant Commander Chase Matthews. Lieutenant Commander, what does it mean to have the Vice President here? Oh, well, we're very excited to have him here. Uh, we uh, are excited to show off our ship and show him the capabilities of the Harry S. Truman and uh, the capabilities of all the sailors that are stationed on board here, the diversity of sailors that we have, and uh, the activities that we, we do around the ship. They're, they're going to have a question, question and answer. If you were able to ask them a question, what would that be? All right. Uh, I would all ask right, him where he doing? thinks uh, the future of the Navy is going in the next uh, uh, probably five ready. to ten How years. How are we doing? Like the number of ships? The number of ships, uh, probably Just deployments, where he I thought the area uh, of uh, focus might be in the future. Yeah. And about the future of the Harry S. Truman. Uh, it's possible, sir, but uh, that, that uh, definitely is going to be up to leadership to decide. Lieutenant Commander, thank you very much. It is a very exciting time here on uh, the Harry S. Truman. We will have full coverage beginning at 4, but that's the latest from the Harry S. Truman. I'm Andy Fox, 10 on your side.